Hello, friends, and welcome back to episode 7 of Clockwork Tales of Glass and Ink. We are playing on expert mode, and my name is Cessis. I also stream four times a week over at Twitch under the same handle. The link is down in the description below if you ever want to go check that out and catch me live. Without further ado, let's jump right back into it. Last time when we left off, um, we had just seen Barber heading up the elevator using his family heirloom and leaving these two robots behind protecting said elevator. Um, I'm getting some really like Bioshock vibes out of this room. If you played ever like the first Bioshock game, uh, which we did on stream uh, and it was a really great game. Loved it. Uh, we 100 percented it actually but all the achievements which we're trying to do in this game too we play on expert mode trying to collect everything and see if we can nail all i think 19 achievements on steam let's get this little collectible right here four out of eight the castle bugs let's read about it a golem lies this creature latches on to mechanical men and drinks the mechanical oil from their tanks that is why it's important to check your golem once every year. Huh. Something tells me we're not supposed to go into this room right now. Those smaller robots seem to be as evil as the big one. Yeah, a big uh, robot got uh, ink earlier. And us as well. Okay, so now we have an elevator key. For this one? That chain won't hold my weight. I need something to reinforce it. Hmm. We also need to make up a fire here uh, to get the water running so that we can pick up this key that is in uh, that hole there. Knife sharpener, but we don't have a knife to sharpen. Uh, let's check out the map here and see what locations we have. We have the kitchen and we have the dungeons. Let's head back into the dungeons. We have this diamond that I'm not sure how we're supposed to get out of there. That's probably not it. Um, you don't even want to know what that is. Whatever that green yucky stuff on the floor. Um, so besides the diamond, it doesn't seem like there's anything left in there. I thought that was the cupboard. Never mind. Can we click on something else? Nope. Doesn't seem like it. Unless we can send Matthew in to do something. I don't really spot anything that looks interactable. Meaning that it has to be something left in here, right? What about up there? Ooh, find objects! Yay! I like these ones. All right. Let me know down in the comments below if you manage to spot all these items on the list uh, that you see right here before I manage to get them all. Are you ready? Let's start. First off, we need a nutcracker. Uh, I guess this is a nutcracker. Yes, it is. Egg beater. What is an egg beater? I have no idea what that is. We need a clean pan. Oh, it's probably this pan, but we need something to clean it with first. Maybe this item? No, you don't think that's it. Oh, this is a piece of cheese. So this is probably for the mouse. And where do we have them? Oh, here? Oh, look at the little one. He's just hungry. And now we could grab him. So we need something to clean this pan with. Uh, this cloth? Yes. Nice. A grater. I think that's this thing. And we need a hook. Is this a hook right here, maybe? Possibly? Oh, I don't know. I don't know if there's an achievement to not misclick in one of these. There might be. Sometimes there is. Uh, so I don't want to unnecessarily tap on a little stuff here. An eagle. 
urn in Swedish. Not seeing an eagle. Oh, wait, I am. This. A ladle. Is that like a spoon, but a bigger one? Hmm. I don't think this is... That might be a ladle, right? Yes. Corn. Mice. In Swedish. Chili. Is this chili? I mean, it looks red like chili, but... I kind of thought it was an, some kind of weird octopus or lobster at first. But now I'm not sure. This little red dot might be a chili. I don't know, are there brown chilies? We got pot. Possibly this one? No. Is this a pot? This is a pot? Uh, I thought that was a pot. Okay, never mind. Maybe this? Ah, that's what I meant. And we need a bat. I saw the bat. It's over here. So we might as well try this now. Yes, that was the chili, apparently. Uh, egg beater. Visp? Oh, I didn't know that that was called an egg beater. A hook. What if I press this? That worked out. But we didn't get an achievement, so either there isn't an achievement, uh, or we failed to get the achievement. We'll check that out. Uh, at some point to see if we are making any progress. A hook. I don't think we can use that there, can we? No. Uh, to reinforce this somehow? There we go. Now we can get up to the salon. Nice. Look at this room. Is this a family portrait? They have identical pendants. So, there has to be a second one around. Oh. So, his, is this like his dad and this is Barbara? Or Barbara and his son? What can we do in here? What is this? This place could really use a woman's touch. Some flower for starters. Flowers. <laughs> we found another bug. Five out of eight. Mostly harmless steam bug that's found of sulfur in all its form. It's been known to eat a box of matches. Match tips in an hour. Hmm. So is the like top part of matches made out of sulfur? I did not know that. Rocks exhibition. No point in browsing it unless I know what to look for. Collecting rocks. Do you all collect stuff? Let me know in the comments down below if you are a collector of any sorts. I used to collect uh, banana stamps when I was a kid. Of all things that you can collect. You know the little sticky things? Um, on the bananas in the store. What is this? It's a case of some sorts. Ooh, we found a knife! Is this some weird kind of rifle? A rifle with feeder for bullets and black powder. Sadly, neither is around. I've decided to move my experiments far from sight. There may be a spy among the servants. I have installed a revolving bookcase in the study. Wow. I would love to have a study in the future with a, you know, bookcase that opens up into a secret room. Wouldn't that be so cool? We found a flask or a container. Canteen, apparently is what it's called. Ooh, what is this? Long time no sweep. I'm not putting my hand in the sticky web. Oh, well, good thing we have a broom then. Ooh, is that a hammer? A rock hammer. Oh, we can get the diamond now, I believe. This is the door into the study. There's a key on the other side of the door. Ooh. Are we supposed to do, you know, where you put like a newspaper or something underneath the door and then you poke out? the key from the other side and you pull the newspaper back into the room and the key will be on it. I think that's what we're going to be doing. There's still something in here. Is it this? The envelopes? Letters from Barbara's father. It seems he wasn't around for his boy. Oh, it's important to have a father figure. Let's go back into the kitchen. 
and let's sharpen this knife on this one nope that's not gonna work oh it's a letter opener oh i thought it was a knife <laughs> am i supposed to open these letters then no okay never mind um let's go back and downstairs anyway uh rock smasher we want to use that on this We found a diamond. I don't know what we need a diamond for. But we got one. Maybe we can, like, make it nice and shiny here? Nope. Apparently not. Are we supposed to distract them with diamond? Nope. Um, well, we already did this puzzle. And here we need to put something on fire so we can get this water thing to work here. But we don't have fire and we don't have any logs of sorts. Um, there has to be a puzzle up here somehow, somewhere. The painting is nailed to the wall. Is there something behind the canvas? Oh wait, is that what I need this for? Yes. The knives can barely cut the paper. I need something much sharper. Oh, wait, the rock. No. Okay, try something else. Something much sharper. Where would I get that from? Like a knife? I haven't seen any knives, though. Uh, what was this again? Oh, is this what we need? Crest pieces. Yeah, we need two more of those. Can I... Put this underneath there. Yes. And then we poke it. Poggers. We got the key. Let's open this door. Upstairs lobby. Are we gonna be... Oh, we are definitely above where the robots are now. This is definitely looking so much like Bioshock. I guess since they're both like steampunk kind of inspired in their design, maybe that's it. But also like the room layout of this. Six out of eight. I'm thinking like of, about the end of Bioshock where you're like uh, escorting the little girl. Uh, that kind of area in the game looks very similar to this. Ooh, we found a puzzle. If you want to find out how I am going to be doing this puzzle, um, you're going to have to wait patiently for the next episode of the game. I hope you enjoyed it and I will see you next time. Take care, make sure you hit the subscribe button and the like button if you enjoyed the video and I will see you. Bye bye for now.